Market. 4 2 win this afternoon. Pretty eventful game at home again. I mean, how do you sum that up immediately afterwards if you can kind of put it into words, really? Yeah, I can't really put it into words. You know, I think probably weren't at our best. Um, but the, the sort of character to come back from 2 0 down and, and score four goals and get three points, it's massive and the feeling's unbelievable in the changing room. And you talk about like the character there, it's something obviously has been mentioned internally, externally, sort of throughout the whole season. But I mean, when you look at a specific game to, I suppose, kind of sum it up, is that a one that kind of does that? Yeah, 100%. You know, I think at half time, the, the message was sort of don't panic. Um, 2 0 down, but we know we've got players that can score goals, um, regardless whether it's half time or 2 0 down. If it's 10 minutes left for 2 0 down, we always feel like we've got a chance. And we just said, you know, the next goal is massive, and if we can get that, we feel like we can go and get two and three. So, yeah, it was just a just a message of don't panic and, and keep on plugging away. And we did that and showed great character to win the game. And how important is that? Obviously, a two 0 down half time, it, it probably feels like things aren't really going your way, and frustration can kind of start to creep in a bit. I mean, how difficult is it to to sort of avoid falling into that and kind of getting a bit frustrated, and then that stops you playing your game, really? Yeah, again, that was a message, you know, don't get frustrated. Things weren't coming off for us in the first half. We were trying things and we're, the ball wasn't quite falling for us. Um, they were hard to break down, we set and they came and they had a game plan and they were very good the first half. And we were getting a little bit frustrated because we couldn't get the it going in the final third like we usually do. Um, so that was just, just massive, to don't get frustrated. And like I say, once we got that, that opening goal, it was like uh, the game opened up a little bit and we knew we could go and, go and get a win then. And another couple of goals for yourself. I mean, it, it looked like you'd possibly pulled something or strained something, stretching for it. Was it just a bit of a, a last ditch one where you've kind of just had to put everything in to kind of get it over the line? No, I was struggling with cramp in my in my calves, and I was feeling just before my second goal. And as I was running through, I could feel feel the cramp coming. Um, I was thinking, just hold on, to put the ball in the back of the net. And I, as soon as I put the ball in the back of the net, my calves just yeah, the, the cramp right up, and I think it was just because we were trying so hard in the game and obviously everyone was just putting everything into it. Um, so I was feeling a little bit tired, but yeah, nothing, nothing major, just, just a bit crap. Yeah, and obviously not an awful lot of time until you, you're back at it away from home on, on Saturday, still four games to go, but obviously you're a confident bunch normally, but that's must only do good things for your confidence going into that. Yeah, 100%, you know, we've got a quick turnaround really. Um, back in training on Thursday, we've got to focus on next game. Next game is massive. Like you say, we've got four games left, four cup finals, but like Mike always touches on, the, the next games are the most important and you've got a massive game, tough game against Kettering on Saturday. So I'm going to go there full of confidence and hopefully get the win.